So when there are hundreds of good games out there for a system, narrowing a list down of your top five favorite is really, really tough, but this guy made it happen. <laughs> What's up my friends, it's Ray back here and I am not even kidding you when I say this is probably the most requested video that I've received in a very very long time. So by popular demand, today I am very excited to be sharing with you guys 5 of my favorite Nintendo 2DS and 3DS games in no particular order that I think are totally worth picking up even in 2018. Get so very hyped! So first up, we have a title that I really enjoyed and actually still pick up every once in a while to this day, Metroid Samus Returns. I've always been a huge Metroid fan and I've played everything from Metroid Fusion on the GBA to the entire Metroid Prime series on the GameCube to Super Metroid on the SNES. Metroid Samus Returns is a return to form for the series and if you enjoy shooters or just side-scrolling adventures, this is one that's sure to give you one hell of a fun challenge. Next up, we have one I've been thoroughly enjoying as of late, Luigi's Mansion. Now I talked about this game a whole lot in my full review that I uploaded this past week so you guys can go check that out over on my channel if you want to hear my full thoughts on it. I'm going to keep it brief here though in this video. Luigi's Mansion here is a 3DS remake of the original GameCube classic that launched over 17 years ago and it now has enhanced visuals, sounds, and gameplay. I've never had the chance to experience the original back in the day and having beat this 3DS version it just really has me thinking to myself why haven't I played the original? This is such a unique game that is very different than anything Mario that you're used to. I mean, who would have thought at the time that Luigi would star in his own quirky horror game with a ghost-busting vacuum on his back? I don't think anyone did, but it actually works really, really well. This game is so creative and it's so fun. Moving forward, here's one that really needs no introduction, Super Smash Bros for Nintendo 3DS. Why do I love this game, you ask? Well, it takes everything that you know and love about Super Smash Bros and puts it on the go. Even with Ultimate on the horizon, I still think this is a must-have 3DS title for anybody who has a 2DS or a 3DS. The game runs extremely well no matter what version of the console you're rocking, and honestly, you just can't beat the portability of this version. Sure, Ultimate's going to be portable on the Switch, but nobody knows the battery life how the switch is gonna last you know for those who don't have a switch or aren't planning on getting one this is definitely an excellent alternative Next up, second to last, we have Mario Party the Top 100. So this spot on the list was actually a toss-up between Mario Party and WarioWare Gold. Both are fantastic pick-up-and-play collection games that you cannot go wrong with. But as far as the rapid-fire micro games are in WarioWare, it was Mario Party the Top 100 that stood out to me a bit more. And I really do think this is one of those heavily underrated games that definitely doesn't get the attention it deserves. Although there aren't any real boards like other Mario Party games, this one here is just a straight-up collection featuring 100 of the best mini games from the Mario Party series. It is the ultimate pick up and play game and you guys know how much I love bite sized games. Not to mention a lot of these mini games hold a special place in my heart from my childhood. Combine those two things together and you get a guilty pleasure game for Ray in Mario Party the Top 100. And finally it wouldn't be a Ray's favorite 2DS or 3DS games list without a Pokemon game and I think this is the spot I struggled the most with choosing for. There are just so many fantastic Pokemon games on every single Nintendo system but the 3DS was the console that pushed the series forward with Pokemon X and Y. If I only had to choose one though at this current moment, I'd have to go with Pokemon Omega Ruby. As big of an impact as Pokemon Y and Sun had on me, it was Omega Ruby that really stood out. This took everything I knew and loved about Pokemon Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald on the Game Boy Advance to the next level, and it ultimately became my third most played Pokemon game of all time, right behind Crystal and Pearl. If you're looking to return to Hoenn or explore Hoenn for the first time, this is a fantastic Pokemon adventure and this is definitely my favorite on the 3DS. I highly recommend it. Alrighty guys, that's about it for this video. If you enjoyed it or found it helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button because it always helps out the channel. And also leave a comment down in the comments box down below letting me know what your favorite Nintendo 2DS or 3DS game is. Is it one that I have here on this list? Is it another one? I would love to know your thoughts down in the comments box down below. So that's about it guys, until the next video, I will catch you guys later, peace!